welcome to another movie review. I'm Timmy Treacle, and here's today's movie review. And I am reviewing the movie Tag. Now, this was released on June 15, 2018. It is a comedy movie based on a true story of real life friends playing a game of tag for one month a year. This movie had a $28 million budget and it made $76.6 million at the box office, making it a nice big hit. And this movie was directed by Jeff Tomczyk in his directorial debut, written by Rob uh, McKendrick and Mary, or I'm sorry, Mark Stylman. And like I said, this is based on a true story. It received mixed to positive reviews with critics and fans alike. It has a 6.7 out of 10 on IMDb, a 55% on Rotten Tomatoes, and 86% on Google. And Cinema Score, who polled um, audiences who watched this movie in theaters, they gave it an average grade of a B plus on an A plus to F grade scale. And this movie, of course, uh, has a great cast: stars Ed Helms, Jeremy Renner, John Hamm, Ilsa Fisher, Leslie Bibb, Jake Johnson, Hannibal Burris, Animal Wallace, and Brian Dennehy. And like I said, it centers around a group of friends who one month a year play the game of tag. They're spread throughout the country. And during this one month, it's open season. And if you don't remember who is it, you don't know when they're coming for you or how they're going to get you. But in this movie, and this is a spoiler alert if you haven't seen the movie, one guy in this group has never been tagged. In the 30 years they've been playing and so the other group decide to get together and go after this person now since they didn't uh, allow no women in the group you know there's no women in it but they can participate in some way and uh, during flashbacks you see them getting uh, tagging someone when uh, they're having a kid and uh, they started this game when they were nine years old and this is what true friendship is or should be like. Even though you grow up, you get older, there's still no reason why you still can't have fun and reconnect. And I find this really hilarious and it is just great. An R-rated comedy is exactly what this needed to be. Because if there's anything less, it wouldn't be nearly as funny, in my opinion. And by far, this is my favorite comedy of the year. I think it's the best comedy of the year. Um, don't get me wrong, Game Night and Blockers are both hilarious, but I think this one is the best so far in 2018. Don't know how many more we're going to get the rest of the year. Uh, this year is closing up. We have less than, well, just about a quarter of the uh, year left. And uh, yeah, I've only seen, this is my 22nd movie of the year so far but there's so many more I want to see most of them are already out I just can't find them yet but the big ones I want to see uh, still haven't come out to rent yet uh, this one come out in June and I'm just now watching it in August uh, that's that's what sucks about not being able to get out to the theaters uh, to watch these movies because I have no way uh, with my disability but this is an awesome movie I love the concept. I love the story of real life friends playing this game of tag for one month a year. Um, I don't know if the true story is one month a year or if it's just all year round. But regardless, I love this movie. It was nonstop last from beginning to end. I love Ilsa Fisher in this movie. She was. She reminds me of the character she played in Wedding Crashers. Freaking hilarious. Ed Helms, John Hamm. Jeremy Renner. Jeremy Renner in this movie, by far, with all the action and stuff he does, is phenomenal. Uh, I love how far they go to not be tagged in this movie. But, uh, yeah, this is a hilarious movie. If you haven't seen it, check out Tag. You won't be disappointed. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10 and two big thumbs up. Definitely check this movie out. And if you haven't seen Game Night or Blockers, check those movies out as well. Um, but 
in the comment section below. If you've seen this movie, give me your thoughts and opinions. And let me know if it's your favorite comedy of the year or it's Game Night Blockers or something that I haven't seen uh, is your favorite comedy of the year. If you know of any other comedy movies that you think I should watch, list them in the comment section below. But if you like this review, hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button and let's talk movies. New, old, any genre, I don't care. I love movies. Horror movies are my favorite genre. Comedy is a close second. It's like 1A, 1B. But uh, yeah, other than that, I thank you guys for watching this movie review. And if you want, share this video with all your friends and family. And let's get everybody involved. The more, the merrier. But till then, I thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time in my next movie review. Check you later.